Hello and welcome to the Polish Foodies YouTube channel. Today I want to teach you how to make grahamki, delicious Polish whole grain rolls, uh, buns that you can eat for breakfast, for lunch, all day long. They are really popular in Poland and they are the substitute of the uh, white bread rolls that are not so healthy. Uh, so in this recipe we have more uh, whole grain flour uh, than uh, all-purpose flour. So I have two and a half cup of whole grain flour and one and a half cup of uh, all-purpose flour. You can use only whole grain flour if you want, but the buns will be quite heavy. If it's okay for you, then you can do it. Uh, so uh, I also have um, one cup of warm water, uh, one package of uh, one package of instant yeast, which is one uh, one and a half tablespoon, two tablespoons of oil. I am using uh, canola oil. Uh, sunflower oil is also good, but you can use any oil you want. Uh, two teaspoon of teaspoons of salt and one teaspoon of sugar. So the whole recipe will be posted in the description of this video if you want to print it. And right now we need to knead the dough. You can either make it in the bowl, on a flat floored surface or in a food processor. I'm doing it in the food processor. So this recipe is for eight, maybe six uh, grahamki buns. Uh, if you want them big, then you have six. Uh, if you want smaller, you have eight. So right now I'm just kneading the dough in the food processor for about 10 minutes so that all the ingredients incorporate. And after that, we will wait for the dough to grow. sugar yeast and finally the water and for 10 minutes we are needing the dough so my dough is ready and right now I just need to transfer it to a bowl and wait for about one hour for the dough to double its size. As you can see it's not sticky, the dough is quite solid and this is how it should be. So all is clean in here. So this is how it looks like and uh, we are waiting for the dough to double its size for one hour probably. So this is my uh, dough for Graham Q right now, it of course double its size. So I realized that I made a mistake telling you that this is whole grain flour. I'm sorry, it's of course whole wheat flour. So just to make sure even Graham flour is available on Amazon if you are from the US. So right now I'm just putting the dough on the flour surface, knead it for a bit and divide it into three or four pieces depending on how big, big you want your rolls to be. I think I'm going to make six rolls, so three pieces. And then each piece divided into smaller. So we have six rolls all together. Okay. And now I'm just making the roll. You can do it in hands. So the rule is that you want your the top of the roll to be even. The bottom made look worse <laughs> because it will grow anyway but the top should be like that so this is my first roll uh, so it co when it comes to the shape 
Uh, in Poland it's either round or grahamki are often made in oval shape like that so this is grahamka also so I will just make some like that some like this I will see which one will turn better okay Okay, and when you are done, now it's time to um, preheat the oven to 392 Fahrenheit degrees, which is 200 Celsius degrees. And in the meantime, the rolls will, will grow on this baking tray for a while. So you can cover them with your kitchen cloth. And right before baking, we will brush it with milk or egg white to make them more shiny. Our grahamki has grown a bit and the final step is to uh, brush them with milk. In my case it's plant-based milk and the oven is already heated so we are going to bake them for half an hour. If you want, you can make some incisions or cuts on top of uh, these rolls so that they look better. But traditionally, grahamki are rather uh, plain, just like that. Okay, and do the oven for half an hour. So I think our rolls are ready. Yes, so they are, look exactly as they should because they are brownish on the top uh, and right now we need to wait for them to be cold because if you slice them like that they will just throw apart. So I hope you like this video, uh, thank you for watching, if you want to see my other Polish recipes you can watch my other videos, I hope to see you next time, bye bye.